Okay, what's up guys? My name is Alam and we are in Good Maze today with Khadija and we're gonna do a mock test. Say hello Khadija. Hi. Hi. Okay. Right, we're gonna do a mock test. So quickly Khadija, um, the test is about 38 to 40 minutes, okay? Throughout the drive, examiner will tell you to follow the road ahead unless the roadside road must tell you otherwise. If the examiner wants you to turn left or right, it will give you plenty of time and notice, yeah? There will be 20 minutes of independent driving following sat nav or signs. In our case, we'll just do sat nav today, okay? And they'll get you to do one maneuver and they may ask you to do emergency stop. And they will also pull you over a few times, okay? Got it? Yep. All right, now, before we get going, did you study the tell me questions? Some of them, yeah. Okay. Right, let me ask you one, okay? Okay. Tell me where would you find the information about the recommended tire pressure? In the vehicle handbook. Very good. Well done. Okay, good. So we're going to drive off and when you're ready and at the end of the car park, I'd like you to turn left and the, then the sat nav will kick in. Okay. And then we'll continue following the sat nav. Okay. Yep. When you're ready, let's go. Okay. You will arrive at your destination at 2.55 p.m. So we're going left at the end of the road? Yeah. At the end of the road, turn left, Granton Road, then at the end of the road, turn left. Turn left, then, at the end of the road, turn left. And then I'd like you to pull over to the left for me, please, just after the hump somewhere. Don't worry about the driver this occasion. Okay, that's fine, thank you. Have one you ready for me, please? Turn left, A1083, Green Lane, then bear right, B177, Good Maze Lane.
remember that junction we'll talk about it later on, okay? Yep. And continue straight on at the next roundabout. straight on to the next roundabout. After 600 yards, turn left, A124, Long Bridge Road. yards, turn around when possible. So what I'd like you to just continue straight on. You see that there's a car park there. We're going to go right into that car park. Okay. There's a car park. Just after the traffic light, there's a gate there. Just 
just keep going round for me, please, to the left. Just keep going round. Turn left, then at the end of the road. Just ignore turn the sign for a minute. Okay. Now, what I like you to do is stop right here for turn me. Left, I'd like you to drive into a bend for the me. Road, turn right. around when possible. Okay, now, the up. It's up to you what you want to do. If you want to put the park and break up, you can do if you want. Okay. Now, what I'd like you to do is reverse back for me, please. Okay. And then we're going to go out that way on the right. Yeah. So reverse back to the left and we're going to go out to the right. going round to the right and end of the car park will be turning left and then we'll continue following the sat -nav. After 50 yards, bear right, Lodge Avenue, then at the end of the road, turn left. Right, turn left or right? Left for me, please. Turn left, then take the third right.
after 200 yards, turn right, Marlborough Road. yards, turn left, Pie Grove Road. Turn left. yards, turn left, B191, Bennett's Castle Lane. Drive on when you're ready for me, please.
driving from now on I'll give you instruction as normal just continue straight on for me please road on the right for me please Keep going here. It's enough room for two cars to get through. Take the next 
start on the right for me, please. Right, we're going right. straight on at the next roundabout. Fast road on the right for me, please. Slow down. That's Then 
what I'd like you to do is pull over to the left for me, please, just by just after this driveway. Let's go this. Just going a little bit more forward. Just keep it nice and close to it. Keep going a little bit more, more, more closer, closer, closer. Okay, that's the end of your test. Okay, switch off the engine for me, please. Think you've done? Um, yeah, I failed. Why? Because I had loads of wide turnings and then the light there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I shouldn't have gone. Or, well, I don't know. Okay, yeah, for key, I shouldn't have gone. What happened with the lights? Which lights you're talking about? You know the clock thing? Yeah, the clock the, tower one, yeah. That one. So, why shouldn't have you gone? Because the car was coming and I should have waited. From which way? From the left. From the left, yeah. yes. But the thing is, I don't know if I was past the box junction. Oh no, but it doesn't matter because I'm turning right. Exactly, exactly. So what you could have done is just stopped at the box, yeah. box junction and you'd have been fine. Because that's where you can stop at the box yeah, when turning right. right. What was I doing? I don't know. I don't think practically when I'm driving. Well, there are a lot of good stuff. I'll get to the good stuff in a minute, yeah? Uh, <coughs> so that one there, yes. Uh, so that box junction always, because the view is blocked on the left, all you have to do is sit in the box. Sit in the box because that's why they're keeping the box junction clear. Yeah. And it would have been all right. Yeah. Okay, so that was unfortunately was a serious fault. Okay, on the observations. There's another one happened on the observation. I can only mark you once. Okay, uh, on the serious, right? Do you remember that junctions we did? Um, we were turning right, and there was a car gave us away from the left. I don't think you noticed it. Oh yeah, that one. Yeah. And then. You were a bit confused and you were waiting and waiting. No, but there was another car coming on the yeah. right and I didn't know like if... Yeah, that was fine. Uh, that was fine you waiting there. It was okay, even that car gave you away and you didn't go and I thought, okay, well done. Very good because you were still... Your view wasn't quite clear so you went Oh yeah, I knew that bit one forward. Anyways. I knew I failed on there. Now, no, you didn't fail for that. Uh -huh. You failed afterwards. Once you got out, yeah. what happened? You were going so slow. Oh, I don't know why I did that. Did you see a Mercedes black car overtook us? No. You've no, I, you know, should I tell you why? Because I didn't know if I was taking the first left, so mm. I was struggling to find out whether I'm taking the wrong turning. So I didn't pick up the speed. Yeah, you should have picked up that I speed. I haven't noticed the black Mercedes. Yet. Yeah, there's a vehicle that came really fast from behind, and you know. Uh, so, because once you made the turn, it was fine. You just but had I to get going. Up the speed. But I think you were you were concentrating on the sat nav. For yeah, that turn. I was. Yeah. I was. yeah. And that slowed you down, so you just should have made that progress, and you'd have been fine. Right then, we got to the next one, and where it says after, after I can't remember exactly how many yards it said, and you straight away signaled. Yeah. And then you realized. Yeah, but then I knew. Yeah. Then I stopped, and then I did it again. Why didn't you take that turn? I don't know. I can't take it, isn't it? Of course, because now you signaled, right? No, I Going the wrong turn. way, the examiner will not fail you. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So you should have taken that turn. Now, because you signaled and you didn't take that turn, now you're going to the next one, that signal becomes? A major. Misleading, okay. yeah. Because you're misleading other traffic. Okay. Yeah? At the last minute, if you realize you're going the wrong way, that's fine, just go that way. As long as you're allowed to, as long as that road is not, it's not a no entry road, okay? Yeah. Or a one way road that you can't go in. Yeah. Yeah? Then you're okay. You should have gone for that one. Yeah, so that was that one there. Um, Can we talk about the parking? Yeah, I'm getting to the oh. parking in a minute. There's another one as well. Um, undue hesitation. I thought that one was tied in with the one where the lady was going to be told to let me go. Where was the hesitation? I don't remember. We got to Maysbrook Road. Yeah. And on that Maysbrook Road, what happened is... This, this is the meeting yeah, it, yeah, Oh it, yeah, yeah, that one, oh yeah. It's a, yeah, I know it's a narrow road. But you could get going. There's t in, in, enough room for two cars to get through. Yeah. And you kept on stopping, kept on stopping. Every time you saw a car coming. And the guy behind was getting really frustrated with us. Yeah, I know, but then I was thinking like you have to do the like, you have to really walk with the car when you're in those situations. Yeah, so keep walking then. Keep oh. going. 
Yeah. We were not walking, were we? We just stopped. Yeah. Yeah. If you had the walking speed there, we would have just been, carried on. Yeah. And after I told you, look, two cars could fit in. Did we not manage you all right? Yeah, we did. Yeah, we yeah. went through him. And there's another incident happened before that actually. Um, the one where there was a parked cars on the left. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. No, because I didn't think that was that many parked cars and then I realized that there's parked cars and after I was like, okay, now I need to indicate. But then the lady was looking that way and I was like, does she know I'm indicating? And then she clearly was. And then I went in and then obviously I knew that was wrong. Yeah, I made loads of mistakes today. Yeah, those parked cars, you know, on that road. Just always stay on the right. Stay on the right. Oh, God. Because you can see the parked cars, just position a bit more to the right mm -hmm. and you find you're going over the humps and things like that. That would have been okay. okay. All right. Now, parking. What happened with the parking? Like, it just takes me to, I don't know, I just hate that car park. But the last time we got it all right. No, we did it. Yeah, we sorted it out afterwards, right? Yeah, first, first, and then first I, yeah, I, did, it. It. I did it though. Yeah, exactly. I did it in the end. Well done, you did do it, right? Yes. Now, it did get in at the end, so you didn't give up, which is good. No. But what the examiner would not allow you is too many corrections. What? If you keep on going back, forward, back, forward, back, forward. Now, you went twice back, yeah? Yeah. And then I managed to get it. And then you managed it. Okay, fair enough. Don't give up. Yeah. If if it's broken, fix it. Okay? Yeah. Don't leave it broken, okay? If you're over the line or you're not in the line, and if you need to fix it, fix it. Okay? Um, now, if you go two, two times, up to two times, maybe they will look at it and maybe it's okay, yeah? But three, four times, they might not allow it. Well, really? I yeah. thought you could take your time doing it. Well, you not can take long. it back. Why do you think that? Yeah, you, no, it's, it's not about timing. It's about, it's about how long you, how many times you're doing it, going forward and back, forward and back. Oh, well, now I'm scared. Now. Okay, what about, what about how now, I Now, how you did it, that was fine. Okay. It was fine. I was it was in, all right. Yeah. Now, the thing is, if you get it wrong, if you're not in the box, what did I say to do? Reverse all the way back. No. Yeah. Yeah. Reverse. I did. No, but I didn't. No, well, but there was the van. First time when you did, yeah, you went back and you start adjusting slightly. Don't adjust, just go back straight, okay? And then, as you go forward, then adjust. Yeah. Because first time when you reversed back and then you went forward straight back to the same place. Yeah. You didn't do any adjustment. No. Then you went back again. And then I fixed it. And then you fixed it. Again, you could have done a little bit better. Yeah, but I was. But, but, yeah. but, you know, you, you, it wasn't quite straight. We went slightly angled. Yeah. That doesn't matter. As long as all four box, yeah. lines within the bay, that's okay. fine. Yeah. So that was that. Yeah, but apart from that overall, you know, you, you were making a good progress. Yeah. Because of progress everywhere, and it, it was really good. You haven't got many minors, you know, only on, only three. It's just the majors. It's the majors. The ones, ones that I make are the serious ones. Yeah. So those are the ones we need to be careful of. Yeah. Yeah. And don't second guess yourself. Most of the time, you're okay. Okay, fine. Okay. If I make, if I indicate wrong, just go through that turning if I can. <sighs> I don't. I need to think. I need to think. I'm not using my brain. Like. Mm. I know that I can stay in the box when I'm turning mm. right, but I don't know why I just didn't. Yeah, you were not thinking there, I say. Yeah, I was, I was so nervous. Oh, you were Look, everybody gets nervous in the chest. If you're not nervous, right, then you're not normal, yeah? yeah? But don't let the nerve get the better of you, yeah. okay? you just got to go on the test day and enjoy the drive. That's okay, the well, what, what do you think? I think it's a 50-50 now. Mm. Oh, it's a bit more than 50. You, you, you can do it. You sure? Yeah, we had quite a few mock tests, right? Okay, we haven't been getting the right result on the mock test, but do you not feel confident with yourself? How was this compared to other mock tests we had? This was better. Exactly, so we've made improvement, right? Yeah. Yeah, this was yeah. better, but um, yeah, it's just 50 50, we'll see. Okay, test, you know, on the test day, it doesn't matter how much you're prepared or not, right? Um, still could go wrong, right? But long, you know, a lot of people um, have problems because they get, you know, if if you if you get nervous, mm. if you get too nervous and you let the nerve get the better of you, then obviously. You, you know the you know you know like in videos when they say when you're finished, like do I put should I put the parking brake or does one right. yeah I that's a good question right know? so with this car yeah basically you, when you were doing the bay parking 
It's got auto hold, so yeah. this handbrake is automatically applied. Yeah, so you don't have to. But will the examiner know that? Yeah, of course, they know yeah. that. They so I don't need to do all You this. don't need to. And at the end of the test, when the examiner will say, okay, I'd like you to switch off the engine. So once you switch off, just, yeah. Yeah. if you had a manual handbrake, then, then apply it ma manually. But okay. with this, it's, it's called auto handbrake. Yeah. So they will know, it doesn't matter. They will know, yeah, okay. they know it. Yeah, and, and it's perfectly fine, it's allowed. Okay, fine. All right. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. That's it. See you on the next one.